Miss Jackie, if you spoke to your pastor in confidence and he tells your business to the congregation in church, how do you deal with it? First of all, how, how do you know he's telling just your business? You don't know who else came to him with the same situation or something similar. And him dealing with it is not, ex not to expose you, but to help you. Um, and so if you are sitting in your seat feeling guilty, you don't know who that's going to help. You don't know who else is sitting in the congregation that has gone with, to him about the same thing, that has said uh, maybe something similar. And he's trying to stress a point, or he's trying to empower you how to get over that. Or he's trying to inspire you how to deal with it. Don't take it personal. It's something that we, we, we do as ministers to try to help people. Not necessarily to, to expose you, but to help you you and others because there are other people that are sitting there that are probably going through the same thing that you're going through that would never go to the pastor or it may be somebody who went through something similar and he feels like it's time for him to speak on that so if it's time for him to speak on it give an opportunity to pour into your life to inspire you and to help you grow from that one situation i remember um in, even in, in 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 when daniel when daniel was getting ready to be put in the lion's den he felt so badly because he had lived his life in front of the people. He was doing everything he could to do what was right, but he was forced to be thrown in there. When, you're thrown, when you feel like you're being thrust into something, the best way to handle that is to, is to pray and ask God to give you foresight and insight as to how to handle it. Don't take it personal. And that's what we all do as people. That's our human per personality of everybody. We tend to take things personal. Don't take it personal. It's only meant to help you to grow, to become greater.